I told him, too much running is not good for you. Look what happens. I'm very sad now. Saturday morning and we're going to get out the house a little bit since the electricity is off and uh, it's now being almost three days oh, it is now three days later Abigail is driving of course so in the end it turned out to be a fracture of the head of my radius not too bad a fracture and it's not displaced meaning I didn't need surgery so there's talk about having to drain the fuse that's in the joint I'm not up for that I can tell you now <laughs> and just have to do, supposed to do x-rays again in two weeks time just to see that the alignment is still there. Whoa. Okay, try and see where we can get some ice cream because I've got to pay back Abigail for her nursing skills. I'm not gonna comment on said nursing skills right at the moment. So, uh, what's not your fault? I said it's not my forte. Oh, okay, it's, apparently it's not her forte. Yeah, she is. I am trying. Oh, this is where I have my x-rays. It was done by Morton and Partners here at the Christian Barnard Memorial Hospital. And I must say, that was quite a good experience. Okay. Thank you, Morton and Partners. Not sponsored. It's like out of the lift to the long or people just driving. Okay, Abigail is not I'm not happy with the way people are driving today. So at the moment we can't decide where to go for the ice cream. There's quite a few places. Well, actually we count four that we can go to for some good vegan ice cream. So in the end we've decided we'll come to the waterfront to get the vegan ice cream. Do you like this part of the uh, waterfront complex? The canal district is what it's called. What do you think, Abigail? Maybe this car will have enough leg room for me. Um, parallel park there. So the food market at the v and waterfront didn't have any ice cream because of the load shedding. They had not had delivery of the ice cream. So we sat down, had some sushi. Look at this. I am trying something new here, having seaweed. I think I might have had it before in the past, but I just saw it going past here and it looked very interesting. So I'm going to give it a bash. It is interesting. <laughs> I've got to do it with a non-dominant hand. My left hand has gotten better at stuff. You have to go to the toilet, you know. So after the sushi, we went to uh, look at the ice cream again and it, indeed it had arrived. But there's no chocolate. No vegan chocolate. So now we're walking to the market. Yep. The authentic Oranjezucht Oranje farm market, which is just outside of the waterfront. And uh, they've got some vegan ice cream usually as well. And we're hoping for, oh, I can't lift my arm. Trying to cross my fingers mm -hmm. for some chocolate ice cream there. As we were standing in line, the chocolate Ran out. Ran out. We are destined not to have vegan chocolate ice cream today. Well, we could go to Long Street. Okay, we're on a mission. It's on the way home. Here we go for vegan ice cream shop number three. Okay, so what's successful? Yay! <laughs> now Abigail's happy? Yeah, and John's happy. And this is this is payback for the nursing. <laughs> so 
So after a successful hunt for the chocolate ice cream, I'm walking here next to the little Lisbjerg River. I'm going to show you exactly where I fell down. I think that's a good end to the video. If this was the UK, I'm sure I could sue the city. But this is South Africa, so uh, yeah, it won't work here. But let me show you what it looks like. Just hitting your foot just at the wrong time in the stride and down you go, broken off. So this was kilometer number one, so that's less than a mile. And uh, I do 10 Ks, so still had more than five miles, nine kilometers left. And I got up and I thought, well, that's not too bad. And I kept on running. I had to finish my 10 K run. So nine Ks later, I was in excruciating pain, but I did it. So if you like this video, just give it a thumbs up. At least leave a little comment. You can also subscribe. That's always nice. And uh, if you ever get to visit Cape Town, of course, it's a lovely place. Nice and sunny day here at the uh, beginning of autumn or fall. Come here and visit us in Cape Town. <laughs>